What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt Deville with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Bob Arum. Bob Arum, according to Michael Benson, has declared that he wants to make a Conor McGregor versus a Terrence Crawford fight next. The promoters, the promoters said that they were pursuing this with Dana White and are open to doing a two-fight boxing slash MMA deal as Crawford has a wrestling background. Hmm. Okay. This is news for your ears. Now, Terrence Crawford, I know what they're, I know what Bob Arum's trying to do. They know McGregor is very popular in the UFC world. Okay. He's crossover to the boxing world. You know, he used to be a boxer, an amateur boxer back, back, back in the day. But he's very good at, you know, hyping up fights. Terrence Crawford is a very, very skilled fighter. In fact, one of the best fighters we have pound for pound today. But he's not really that promo guy. So I think Bob Arum is trying to use Conor McGregor's star power to create a, 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 a spectacle, okay? Some events with Terrence Crawford in it to bring Terrence Crawford's profile to where he feels it needs to be. That's what I think. I think, Bob Arum, I am the man that makes this shit happen. <laughs> you know. Um, Terrence Crawford can whoop ass ass on McGregor any day of the week, and he can probably wrestle him to the ground and beat the shit out of him. <laughs> you know, boxing, of course. I think Terrence Crawford and uh, Conor McGregor, they both have long, rangy arms, both powerful, I feel. You know, McGregor's a switch hitter, so is McGregor. You know, when he showed his his uh, talents against Floyd Mayweather when they fought the only fight that he had with a true boxer, which is Floyd Mayweather. And uh, boxing, there's a no-brainer. It would be a popular fight. It would be very interesting, but M M Terrence would destroy him. You know what I mean? Terrence is in his prime. He would destroy him. Now, as far as MMA goes... Just because Terrence Crawford has a wrestling background, what is what, what kind of shit is that? You know, I I don't think he Terrence Crawford has a born to lose tattoo on his chest. So if he goes over there on that platform, he's gonna lose. Just like McGregor going taking on Terrence Crawford, that's not gonna be a good fight. And honestly, we don't know what McGregor's take on this is about someone like Terrence Crawford. Okay, that's a live beast. I don't think that he wants to take somebody on like that. And still, he has unfinished business with uh, Floyd Mayweather himself. So Floyd has interest in that. So if you think Floyd, you know, is interested in that fight and really um, and willing to deal with Dana White, because you know those guys are in talks, that fight can happen. A part two could happen. Sure, it could happen. You know, it'll be in a boxing ring, though. It won't be in, in UFC. I doubt Floyd would ever do that. He's too smart for that. That's too risky for him. And Floyd's a businessman. And things with with risk involved doesn't include Floyd Mayweather. Okay? He's too smart for that again. The people around him are too smart for that. So I don't see that this fight is a go. I don't see that McGregor would really want to take on Terrence Crawford. You know what I mean? Why take an ass beating in the boxing ring by somebody that's in their prime, that's young, that's strong, that's thirsty, that's hungry? I don't see it. Versus fighting someone that is, what, a year and a half, what, two years older than when you fought him the last time, which is Floyd Mayweather? I would go with Mayweather if I'm McGregor. But anyway, you guys tell me what you think about Bob Arum's claim to make this particular fight. Please subscribe, and you guys been counterpunched. Peace.